and check out the view from the CTV Skywatch camera looking out to the northeast. And while you do that, I'll just remind you that live professional wrestling takes place tomorrow at the Lethbridge Legion. Bell time is 7.30 p.m. You can pick up tickets in advance at the Legion or at the door. Five degrees is where we're at right now. That's our daytime high. We got down to minus five at 6 a.m. this morning and stayed there for a little bit. But we've actually been at five degrees for a couple of hours now. So holding on to that warm air mass coming out of the southwest. Our humidity level is pretty much where it should be for this time of the year. Pretty average. Temperatures, though, are at average or above average in most areas on this side of the Continental Divide. A little cooler as you look to the west. A lot of cloud cover there. We'll be picking up a little bit of that drift off of that mid-level cloud overnight tonight and tomorrow morning. But as I was saying to Jackie, by tomorrow afternoon, we're looking at sunshine. Satellite map right now is just showing these bands of clouds as they're trying to move across. One skipped across earlier, and we have another one that's uh, lining up and it's going to move across. That cloud cover will thicken up that cloud deck a little bit overnight tonight and hang in there during the morning hours, but by by the afternoon, winds will pick up as the low pressure center to the west of us edges ever closer to the area of high pressure that's dominating the weather in southern Alberta. That'll make the gradient pretty tight in between those two systems and it'll kick the winds up, gusting to about 60 kilometers per hour tomorrow. Forecaster is uh, showing we've got precipitation, of course, in through BC, the higher elevations, and it just wants to put a little bit of precipitation coming across to the northern sectors and cloud deck coming across to the south. And that's the way it looks like for the southern areas that will We'll see uh, just a dry forecast and could see the odd little pocket of precipitation further to the north. But here in the south, it's looking pretty dry tomorrow and a little windy by the afternoon hours as well. Down east, big system trying to push eastward and as it does so, it'll create more snow cover tonight. Uh, snow showers for Toronto and Ottawa into Montreal. Actually, the Halifax area and the uh, extreme eastern edge of Nova Scotia is under warning criteria right now. Could see 15 centimeters of snow overnight tonight from that same system that's trying to push east. And we've got freezing rain in St. John's overnight tonight. And then as you get to Winnipeg, that's where the sun shines out. Minus 7 degrees right now in Winnipeg. Minus 4 and 0 in Regina and Saskatoon. Both uh, locations looking at sunshine right now. 4 degrees in Edmonton. And poor old Vancouver, they're looking at rain off and on till next Thursday from a system that is pushing into BC right now. Whitehorse and Yellowknife looking at mainly sunny skies today. A little bit of cloud cover in the mix uh, for tomorrow and the odd little pocket of flurry over the next three or four days for those locations. For you folks in East Kootenai, overnight tonight you're looking at a low of minus five degrees. A chance of some scattered flurries tonight, but by tomorrow afternoon you'll see a sun and cloud mix. You have a chance of some leftover flurries or showers in the morning for you. Winds will be out of the south at about 20 kilometers per hour. For the Crow's Nest Pass, mainly cloudy tonight, minus six degrees for a low. Also cloudy tomorrow for the most part, one degree for a high, and winds will be gusting to 60 by the afternoon afternoon hours for Medicine Hat. Clear skies, you're far enough east that the cloud cover shouldn't really be affecting you tonight. Anyway, minus 10 for a low. Tomorrow, though, you'll be mostly cloudy for the bulk of the day with the odd little ray of sunshine making its way through. Southwest winds at 20 kilometers per hour in the afternoon. And here in Lethbridge, we're looking at minus 10 for a low tonight. Mainly cloudy, especially after midnight tonight. And then tomorrow, mainly cloudy in the morning. Sun and cloud mix in the afternoon. Winds out of the west gusting to 60 in the afternoon. There's your five-day forecast. Not bad, considering average for this time of year for Lethbridge is two degrees and so we'll hit three degrees tomorrow and then stay above average for the next several days and uh, nice conditions uh, even for Monday if you're lucky enough to have Monday off uh, come out and check out the Rick Hansen relay which take place in Lethbridge Monday and Tuesday so come out and cheer everybody on. Ken congratulations Ken has been nominated by four people and they're all neighbors so they must really like this guy apparently he does a lot during the summer and the winter to keep the entire block looking uh, ship shape. So that's our that's our salute for this week. Have a good and safe weekend everyone and we'll see you Tuesday.